So for an example, let's say you buy a house for $100,000, guys, right? You only put down $20,000. You put 20% down, the bank gives you the other $80,000, okay? Then Le leverage. you put $20,000 into the property to fix it up, which is value add, which is what Kenny was discussing. That property now goes up to $200,000. Then you can go ahead and do a cash out refinance and you could pull out what? 70% a lot of the time yep. is, uh, is what it's right. going to be. Yep. So let's say it's worth $200,000, right? So easy numbers, you, can, you get $140,000. That hundred forty thousand dollars that you get out of that property you purchase, guys. Remember, you only put in about forty thousand dollars of your own money into the deal. Now you're getting one hundred forty thousand out. You can take that one forty tax free, which is the key, yeah. and roll it into buying another asset that's going to make you more money. This is how the wealthy stay wealthy. That off. And your yes. tenant pays it off because this new debt you acquired with the cash out refinance, you ain't paying it. Your tenants are right. So right. why not continue to do that and buy and hold? So that's why strategy is so powerful, guys. And I just want to show you kind of from a nominal perspective. How that works. Yep. So, yeah. 